Hey YouTubers, today we've got a Nissan Qashqai 2 circa 2011. It's the 1.6 diesel. Uh, anyway, I'm going to be showing you a quick way to check your resistance in your glow plugs. Um, it's very simple on these. Hope you enjoy the video. Right, so the um, diagnostics plugged in. We'll just run through and see what we get. It's a Nissan. This is a 2011. It's not the plus two, it's a five seater, not the seven. I've shown six codes for the engine. On the ITV, just they're moaning about P0380 code. Report refrigeration, maybe they will pass current preheating unit, which is a P0380. Um, and this is the reason for the failure of the ITV P0380. That's current. So what I'm going to do now is test the glow plugs. There's a couple of methods to test the glow plugs on these. The glow plugs sit under here. That's a connector for the glow plug. And it sits there, you can see the top of it there. So you can either do them directly on the glow plug Or, this is the, the multi-plug for them. You can test them at the wiring harness here. So what we're gonna do, I've disconnected this multi-plug, it's really straightforward. That's connected. Pull the lever up, slide it out. So we're gonna be checking from the multi-plug here. Connected the negative side of the multimeter to the negative on the battery and what we're going to be doing is checking the resistance of the glow plugs from this multi-plug now knowing these that uh, number one is on the top left so start with one now we need to really see them between seven and eight ohms. Let's see at the minute, if you can read this. Let's go the other way with it. So that's number one, that's high. Number two, very high. So that's two duff. Number three, high again, 1.4. And the last one, number four, again, 1.3, which is high. So, well, that was quite a straightforward video. I uh, hope you found it informative. Um, yeah, pretty straightforward to check those glow plugs without getting too messy. Um, yeah, if you like what I'm doing, please subscribe, like, hit the bell to get notified of the next videos. And any questions or comments, please leave in the box below. Thanks for watching.